<laughs> Ooh, look at that. Look at that beautiful calcite and gold. Ooh, ooh, ah! Well, hey, everybody. Jeff Williams here with AskJeffWilliams.com. <laughs> yeah, I know what we're doing today. Well, think back on my post on Facebook. Remember I told you about the gold in origins of Supergene. It's very important that you learn about that. Why? Because some of the richest gold deposits you can find are in Supergene gold because the gold has been reconcentrated or secondary enrichment down in the limonite, the zones right above the water table. Now remember what I told you on my little chart. You got the Gaussian, which is the iron hat that gold wears, and then you got the leach zone, and then you got the oxidation zone, and then you got the water table. Well, the rich stuff is in the oxidation zone, especially right above the water table. Woo-hoo, a lot of times you'll find limonite in there. And that's what happened to us, and me and Slim, we're out looking around, we found a new deposit. Now, I want you to look at this, come here. Now, down in here, I got a bucket right there of it. See all that beautiful looking limonite? See that? And it's got manganese oxide in there. Woo, that's pretty. Now, I know it don't look like much, but there's actually gold in all of that stuff. Okay, and then we've crushed it down into 100 mesh in this bucket right here. See that? Through the monster crusher. So, and the interesting thing about this gold is that there's barely any quartz in it. It's all mostly clay, kind of like what they find up in Oregon. So what are we gonna do? Well, I'm gonna pan out a sample of it real quick so you can see how rich this is. So come here, take a look at this. Okay, I'm gonna get me a nice healthy scoop. There we go. Now I want you to see, see how much that is right there? That's hardly anything right there. Okay, I got my jeweler's loop right there. All right, I wanna try to pan this out real fast. I don't wanna get you wet. <laughs> get those clumps all crushed up in there. Yeah, I know. See that iron oxide? Man, that's nasty stuff. And I know I'm going fast, but I wanted you to see this because as soon as I processed it, I couldn't believe what I was looking at. Okay, that should be enough. All right, let's see if I can get this on film. All right. Look at that. Look at that. See that? That's all from just that one scoop. See it all? Oh, that's pretty. Let me see if I can tap a line up for you. Look at that. Look at that. All right, I'm gonna get my, my jeweler's loop out here so you can take a peek at it. Get a little bit closer there. I don't know if you can, you can see that. There's my jeweler's loop right there. And let's see, get on in there. You have to get closer. You have to get closer. Where's that little? There we go. There we go. I think. <laughs> okay, come on down. Let's see. I can't hold that for me real quick. Let me see if I can. I know that's a pretty line, but I want you to I want you to get a good look at this. Because I think it's important that you see this. There you go. There you go. I know it's kind of a messed up. There you go. How's that? How's that? Isn't that pretty? See all that super fine gold in there? Oh, that's nice, huh? And that's just out of one scoop. That's just out of one scoop. That's nice. I wanted you to see that. Whew. Okay. Wow. All right. So I'm gonna I'm gonna snuffer all that up and uh, put it in the bottle. And of course, we got buckets and buckets of this stuff coming out of this new area that we just discovered. Ooh, I've never seen this much gold in one particular seam before. Ooh, man. What I'll do is later on we'll take you up to the spot where we're getting this and I'm gonna explain the geology and what you should be looking for so you can identify it too when you get up there in the hills and you start trying to strike out on your own. So anyway, I wanted you to see this real quick. I thought I'd put a smile on your face on Black Friday. So anyway, until next time, this is Jeff Williams with SJFWilliams.com saying if you want the gold, you gotta be real bold. So come on, let's go.